Well, it's certainly my honor and my great pleasure to be joining this great group of people in the Southern Tennis Patrons Foundation Hall of Fame. I've been uh, around tennis now 50 years, and it has been an integral part of my life. And I know that same passion is shared by all others in this group. And I first got involved as a player at age nine in Birmingham, Alabama, under the tutelage of Wade Heron. And he taught me so much about the game and played junior tennis and the memories of staying in people's houses and being driven from town to town playing was uh, something that was very special to me. And luckily had a good high school career and was able to play varsity tennis at Georgia Tech after I was recruited by Jack Rogers. And uh, at Georgia Tech, we had uh, had some fun times, and Wally Johnson finished as my coach there. And uh, on a side note, when I got out of college, I weighed 165 pounds. Things have changed. And uh, from there, I went into the tennis business. I was first uh, director of tennis at Big Canoe in North Georgia. And from there, went to Indian Hills for 10 years. And uh, had so many friends and so many people that we taught and took to tournaments, and, uh, and, and that was a, a very enjoyable 10 years of my life. Also at the time, uh, I married uh, my wife and uh, had three uh, wonderful daughters. And uh, from there, went to the Standard Club as the athletic director and served there until taking on the role as the executive director of Southern in 1989. And uh, from 89 to present, I've served from, for 15 presidents who have all taught me an awful lot about the game of tennis and had the most incredible staff over the years, uh, many of which I stay in touch with today that have left many years ago. So it's been just a uh, terrific run. I'm so proud of all the accomplishments of Southern Tennis and the Southern Tennis Patrons Foundation over those years. And, uh, and, and I am just honored to be a part of this group.